welcome back to our channel PYT and in this video we are going to discuss on the one of the command in command prompt so in our previous video we have discussed upon the command IP config and in this video we are going to discuss on other command which is the IP config slash all it is similar to the IP config command but we'll be getting more information so now let me perform the IP config slash all so before performing this command let me uh, tell you this command okay by using the ip config slash we can get the detailed information of the network settings so by using the ip config slash all we can get the detailed network settings information by using the ip config we will get the overview of the network settings and by using the ip config forward slash all we will get the detailed network settings information so now let me click on enter see we got all the information see here we got here we have given the command as ip config slash all then we got the complete information like the windows ip configuration means the host name host name is pyt what is the node type whether it's a hybrid or not and the ip routing whether it's enabled or not then we also got the complete details of the network adapter settings like the ethernet adapter 2 and the local area connection the local area connection 1 connection 2 then also the vm net 1 and also the vm net yet we got the complete details even including the net bios information also so that is why we will be calling this command ip config slash all as the detailed information it gives the detailed information of the network settings so here we can see for the example for the vm net one adapter settings we got the description this is the vmware virtual ethernet adapter for vm net one so this is a for the vm machine actually and whether the dhcp is enabled or not even the auto configuration is enabled or not okay we can see the subnet mask the ipv4 address the dhcp server address okay and even the net bios uh, over tcp ip protocol whether it's enabled or not the same information for the other one also vm net 1 and also for the vm net 8 see also for the lan adapter wi-fi we got the ipv4 address the subnet mask okay the dhcp server details and all but when it comes to the IP config, when we performed only the IP config command, I mean only the IP config, we got only the overview of network settings. So if we scroll up, complete to the top, okay, here we performed IP config. And if we check for the VMNet 8, if we check for the VMNet 8, then only we got the IPv4 address, the subnet mask. But if we scroll down, If we scroll down here for the VMNet 8, see here we got the DHCP information also. We got the DHCP server information, then the NetBIOS information, and whether the DHCP is enabled or not, even the IPv4 address, the subnet mask, the when was the lease obtained, and when is the lease, the IP address is going to expire. So we got the complete information by using the command IP config forward slash all so if you want to know the detailed information of your network settings then you can use this command ip config forward slash all or if you want to just know the overview of the network settings then you can use this command ip config so this is what the difference between both the commands ip config and the ip config forward slash all by using the IP config, we will be getting only the overview of the network settings. But by using the IP config slash, I mean forward slash all, we will be getting the detailed information of the network settings. Thank you for watching this video. And for more videos, please do subscribe our channel, PYT.